Charles, I gotta talk to you. They'll have to wait. I gotta get ready for the breakfast call. Let them wait. This is important. Jake, I'm busy. Rose, you'll have other customers. You only have one future. What I want to talk about concerns the rest of our lives. I've thought about that, too, and I'll come to a decision. I made a decision. Roast beef for lunch? I've just made a death. Is we'll talk now. Fast. Not now. Yes, Rose. Now. You've been avoiding me for days. Now, I know how you feel about all this. I know how hard it's been for you. But there are things we have to talk about. Like Lou and Blackie, and especially you and I. I'd rather not. Why not? What good would it do? What good would talking do? It might bring us closer together. Are you in the least bit interested about that anymore? That's not going to happen. I've given this a lot of thought. I don't see how we can continue our relationship. I see the question is, how can we end it? It's the best thing for both of us. No, no, no. It is not the best thing for me, and I refuse to believe that it is for you. There's just so much conflict. We're fighting all the time. Is that how you see it? That's the way it is. You know it as well as I do. There's just... So, so many things keeping us apart. The only thing keeping us apart is you. Okay, if it's easier for you to blame me, that's fine. Rose! I love you. I want to marry you. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. No. Rose! <laughs> I thought you loved me. What changed that? Circumstances. I'm afraid that's not good enough. It'll have to do now. Please go. Not until I get a straight answer. What the hell has happened to us? Lou is dead. Now, I feel real bad about that, too. But I'm not gonna stop living because of it. Jane. This St. Rose Act has got to stop. You can't bring in waves here for the rest of your life. You want somebody to love? Try me. But I want a wife, not a martyr. I am, if you're willing to grow up. It's my life. I'll live it as I want, with whomever I want. That's plain enough. Too much you're fighting this afternoon. Yeah. Do you have a paste? Oh, I'm sorry. She's in emergency surgery. Oh, that's too bad. Listen, uh, could you tell her that I have a business uh, thing to see? Okay? Of course. Excuse me. Oh, hiya, Counselor. How you doing? Oh, Mr. Brock. Are you here drumming up some business? No, no, no. I have all that I can handle. I was just here to see a client. Oh, a doctor? An accident victim. Ah, it's even better. How's business? Oh, I can't complain. Is uh, Delise back on its feet yet? Well, slowly but surely. Uh, it started out a little slow, but that's to be expected, you see. Uh, what we need is a high-powered PR campaign. Our product is better than ever, and we just have to re-educate the public and push our image a little bit. Well, that'll come in time. Well, that goes without saying, but, uh, you know, I'm always in a hurry. I figure if I work hard on this PR campaign, this publicity thing, we're going to be turning a profit before you know it. Frisco! See, I told you you'd find him. Hey. Hey. My. 